Okay, this is Theophilus, Traveler Theophilus. And uh, we ended last episode with the agriculture, so we're going to continue with that. In fact, that would be agricultural research. Um, okay, return to the farmer. Just so you know, uh, you noticed I had the picture, I had put extra, I added extra rooms, and I also added a solar panel. Okay, let's talk to the uh, gardener. How is the gut rot flower, friend? Does it blossom? Is it heavy with fruit? Let's see, a hand in 25 facium. Uh, beautiful friend, we shall make a farmer of you yet. While I prepare a dish of fragrant wonder, another agricultural challenge awaits you. Okay, frost wart. We need dioxide and frost crystal. Now, I believe to repair our ship, we'll need these, um, the original ship that we found that was crashed. I think we're going to need dioxide for that, too. The frost wart is a tricky thing, friend. It flourishes where other plants fail, thrusting its roots through the ice and snow. But such a hard life is not for us. Plant one here in your own home and be spared the pain of winter. Hireling Yen Leo asked me to grow a frost wart plant and prove our hydroponic system can replicate any environment. I accept. Wonderful friend, it is a delicate thing to look at. For such a hardy plant, please do enjoy it. Okay, uh, we have the blueprint. We need to go find um, frostwort and dioxide. Ah, uh, dioxide. Local mineral extract typically found in large deposits or extracted from common minerals after inspection with analysis and analysis visor. Typically found on frozen planets. Now if I left click, it will place dioxide. Okay, so it says dioxide rich planet detected. So first we'll see if it's up here. Mm. I noticed that Opkov has Art Move 4 and that has dioxide. So we're going to go to Opkov to get the dioxide. Dioxide and frost crystal, what we need. All right.
Grow the frost wort in here. We've got the crystal and the dioxide. We need hydroponics tray, which requires four metal plates. Let's make more metal plates. And another hydroponics tray. plant as much of the frost work as we can. I think we'll save some of the dioxide. Hireling Yin Leo, you have mastered the frost work. Your base is already feeling more homely, yes? Confirm 50 frost crystal. Does the way it shimmers in the light not enchant you, friend? I have lost hours to its gentle glisten. But now, a plant of great contrast. Solar vine, solanium, and phosphorus. Your next crop will be solar vine, a plant that grows deep within the mantle of scorched worlds. It seeks out all heat from the sun or the core below. Its roots can extend to such incredible lengths that once it was believed, they never ended. But do not worry, friend. Here, with our facilities, their growth shall be more manageable. Hireling Yin Leo wishes for me to cultivate solar vine, a plant that usually grows only in extreme heat. I accept. If only I shone as brightly as the solar vine, I envy you the joy of discovery, friend. That was Hireling Yin Leo. Okay, so this is under agricultural research. In the next episode, my plan is to um, recover spaceships. So in the next episode will be spaceship recovery. Thank you for watching.